of the things in the letter said that it was a man-made island? You? No, he thinks it's a man-made island. You think it's a man-made island? Is that what you think? No. No. He said it's oh, not no. a man-made island. Oh, no. Is that what I said in the letter? The letter says it's a, yeah. Well, then there's confusion. Mm. Okay. Oh. It is not a man-made Oh. It goes back 1630 when a, when a galleon broke on the shore. All right. And my letter, I was confused in writing the letter. That's what I thought. Okay. <laughs> All right. Wow. Well, okay. So, okay, so at this point you're in discussions with the university does, and the yeah. refuge. Does the letter say that it was a man made island? It yeah. was a man made island and it should not be confused with the pristine natural islands and therefore it should have the right to be developed and added buildings to it and things like that. Well, that's, not, that know, well basically that no, not, none of the but, but that's, laws that apply to offshore islands should apply to your island is what how, is the gist. How can I, I can ungraciously say that I misinterpreted it must have caught me on a bad day hmm. that the island is not man-made, hmm. obviously. Okay. All right. <laughs> I detract. <laughs> Retract. Subtract. Yes. Barton Smith actually spoke on your behalf as your attorney. Did you hire him? I don't want to go into that. Okay. But, uh, that God was, wasn't on duty one day. 